Now, it'd be nice to know how many trade routes are actively coming out of the city as is. I should probably move you to Blancru. It means not getting the production boost here, though. You know what? Actually, let's trade route for maximum production here. Delhi, would that go through Japanese territory? Yes, it would. Okay, I'm going to send you to Cologne, then, because that won't go through Japanese territory, just to get the production boost in Delhi in so that it can finish its power plant a few turns sooner. Greeny has a commercial district. That's good. It's currently building an entertainment center, so it'll be the same logic. We're going to go for a production boost. Here, we'll do it internally. We're going to send you to Dry Meat Shield. A little less money, but it's got the food and the faith. And sure, that's fine. All right. Yeah, I keep trying to improve terrain over here. So, yeah, there's nothing we can build on the jungle. Or on the rainforest. I don't think there's any reason to keep the rainforest around. Rainforest is stupid. What does rainforest ever do for humanity? Nothing. Um, you're going to go right into building a seaport. And hopefully we can build some kick-ass ships there. Now that you've cleared that, you can go ahead and build a mine on here. For Flux Inductor's um, industrial zone. You're going to go and build a mine on the coal here. More suzerain ships lost. Yeah, well, I mean, there's nothing I can do about it. It's not like I can, you know, shuffle my envoys around in between turns, as far as I know. So we'll just wait until we get some more. And yes, thank you for the reminder. I do have money over here to buy a settler on Rocky Mage Island. Thank you very much. And we'll also be building some, or buying some uh, builders here soon. So... We have a very good fleet off the coast of Japan here, ready for some gunboat diplomacy. Not spending much time on research. Screw you, buddy! You mean 177, 165? I'm basically there! It's Arabia that's the big friggin' problem. We're gonna bop them soon. I suppose I could always declare war on Arabia just using ships. But I think it'll still be more practical if we go after Japan, work our way through them, and then do a full-on attack against Arabia. Of course, at that point, it probably becomes pretty easy for us to consider a, a, um, a domination victory. Alright, I want the Bolshoi. Okay, we're going to not do anything more there. The Civic I'm going to choose, what I really want is... Where do we get more great scientist points? Uh, we have to go all the way to a uh, nuclear program. Scorched Earth doesn't lead anywhere. Is there anything useful? Cheaper settlers? Eh. No. That we can ignore probably for the rest of the game. Uh, mobilization. Yes. We want to we wanna do this for armies and everything like that. War of Territorial Expansion sounds like fun too. Urbanization lets us start building neighborhoods, which fixes a lot of our housing problems, although we still have amenity problems. New Carnifex. Well, I mean, I do still need military units over here. You know what? Get started on a musket. I think that's going to be a swell idea. Power plant. Um, I think you can keep increasing your theater district for some better slots for things. Caveman. You have money for a builder? No. Next turn. Go ahead and build a granary, because you're kind of housing capped. Ah, oh, envoys. Excellent timing. Okay. So, I still have Stockholm. I still have Granada. I don't have Palenque. And actually, Japan took it, which is no good. So, we're going to go and enforce that. What can we get for this? Get a great artist. Well, yeah, I don't know if that's going to be the case. You may as well remove the marsh, and then we'll upgrade it with something. Um, your production rate sucks, so I'm thinking mines. And my ships here are just gonna... They're just gonna chill. I don't think I'm gonna chop this stuff. I think I'm just going to lumber mill that. Trader out. Um, I'm gonna send you to... Oh, uh, I'd love to send you to Borbara, but that's too dangerous. I was just going to say, like, you know, set up some things. Um, wow. Trade routes from here are not that good, but I would like to get you a little production boost. So, just go to Drive Meat Shield. It's very safe. Get a little production to help you out. Okay, you got that. You're going to come over here and build me a mine. You have done that. Wonderful. We are going to... Um... 
I don't know. I guess we'll go and hook up the crabs and stuff. That's going to be fine. So our city to the north really can kind of sort of go everywhere. I think maybe right here. One, two, three. Oh, no, it doesn't get the last fish. Never mind. One, two, three. Would get the crabs. Yeah, so then it doesn't matter. Like, whether I go here, here. I mean, I could go further north. But... No, I think this is fine. Right there. Time. We got about 20 minutes left to go. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. More tropical on Saturday, maybe? Maybe. I don't know. It's, but the tropical has been a lot of fun. So it is entirely possible. All right, you're gonna go to sleep too until it's time for war. It's entirely possible we meet tropical some more on Saturday. I don't know. <laughs> well, we could war now and steal some stuff. Oh, who just built a wonder? No, go away. What was built? Oh, these tooltips are terrible. Uh, no. Saladin just finished the Colosseum. Really, the Colosseum now? In 1435, the Colosseum. Okay. Shows you how some wonders... Oh, oh, oh. Excellent. Sources gained. So, espionage successful. So, choose new mission. Alright. Tech boosts. Except mission. Um, you are... You're just going to drop a farm here. And... You know what? I should really look into policies that might give us more amenities. I keep forgetting to look into those. Because I'm always obsessed with raw numbers. So you're in a lumber mill. We can get rid of this little indicator. Sanitation. Um, I don't think we're boosting anything to size 15 anytime soon. No. We just don't have that kind of housing and whatnot. Build a net. Good place for a harbor right over here. Look at the production in the coal. Seven. Freaking crazy. Oh, he criticized me about my research before, and now he's like, you're super awesome. Because I'm actually... I think his tech may have gone down slightly, and mine's gone up to 188. A little bit of a policy change. So he clearly likes anyone who is teching better than him and doesn't like people who tech worse than him. Which to me is a bit backwards. Be friendly with the people who don't know what they're doing. They're easier to conquer and to ignore. All right, we're going to build another mine there because that'll be a really good little industrial zone. You're going to come over here. You are... This is a hill, which is why I'm going to probably chop the wood and then build a mine. Yeah, we're going to do that. Shave several turns off the seaport here. So you're going to be building things there later on. See, this is a forest hill too, so I think we'll go and chop that and then... Um, mine it. Let's get some more fishing boats here. Good old rock mate. Oh, right! I was going to, um, buy a builder over here. Nice. Anything I can faith buy with 2,000? Uh, a great general, which I don't care about. Okay. Although we are very close to uh, another great engineer. Boost towards a race, a space race project construction. That sounds like the sort of thing we need to invest in, because I think we are going, I mean, we're Poland. We have to into space, right? Mm-hmm. Trade for salt with Germany. That what I'm missing. Again, it would be nice if there was a list of things that you are explicitly missing. That's what I need in this mod. Did I, did I just hear barbarian encampment spawn? I feel like I did. Because even the tooltip here doesn't say anything. 85 gold per turn. How about no? How about I give you gypsum on incense... And marble. And you give me basically no gold. I don't know. 50? No, okay. Alright, there we go. Sure. Mm, you're going to mine for some more production over at this end of town. You are going to lumber mill that. You've set that up, which is great. Uh, I think we're just going to lumber mill that, because it's not on a hill. Mr. Worker, you are going to go and get our rice flowing. Excellent. Uh, these are both hills. We could do... I think we are going to, in fact, do a, uh, a chop here. 
and build the granary, and then what comes after that? Oh, you're going to be um, almost certainly building a, a harbor really quickly, because that's a great spot right there. So, um... Start the harbor. Excellent. Hooray! Found city. You are going to be called... Uh, this, this kind of looks Polish. Wubz... Ch... 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 Can I, can I buy a vowel? Um, you are going to go monument into granary. It'd actually be a great site for a freaking um, uh, water wheel if uh, you had a river because of the wheat over there. But that's going to have to do. All right. And I have enough money. You know what? Let's get another builder over here. Blam. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Us drunk advisors preparing some warfare. Let's liberate more land from those liars that lie about your warmongery. <laughs> Employ that bigger army diplomacy. I like it. Well, I don't know if we'll start, like, right away. Again, we had to be a little concerned, because we had the war exhaustion. Um, that's probably worn away at this point. Um, so the question is, you know, can we go with the army that we've got? Are we good, you know, to stop our building up? Maybe. Oh, right. Oh, fuck. That was a... You got a lot of stuff plundered here. That's no good. Repair, repair, repair. Um, yeah, these production rates are really bad. I just start slowly building up a trade over here. That's going to be fine. Your production rates are also really, really, really bad. Just get started in a bank. Maybe we can get you a trade unit over here at some point to boost your stuff. All right, we got another spy. Okay, these are Sumerian cities here, right? We couldn't see them before. Okay, good. And start spying on Sumeria. Excellent. Probably drop some farms over here. That sounds good. And I think over here we will go and clear some more terrain. Um, I'll pull the build a lumber mill on that. So you're gonna go and build a couple of mines here. You are definitely gonna go and farm up the wheat. Or Valley would be good. I don't know, we'll look into a good spot for that. Maybe between episodes. Best Polish city name is still Woods. Yeah, there are special characters in there. Yeah, it, it looks like Lods, but it's more like Woods or Woods or something like that. Rivia's got Livy on mass. All right, that's fine. Urbanization away from biggest boost, but that's okay. I mean, sanitation. At some point, we are actually going to build two neighborhoods. But, no, that's okay. Oh, yeah, because we can't build uh, neighborhoods until we finish our urbanization anyway. So, yeah, we're okay. Uh, lumber mill. And you're going to go and set up more wheat. And you are going to lumber mill that. And next turn. So, how's our score? I mean, our score is much higher than everyone else's. Saladin is still worrisome because of the amount of tech he's got. That has a lot of tech happening very quickly. Gilgamesh, not as much tech anymore. Um, I think I should plan for a bit of a farming triangle over here, although I do want to build more of the Alcazars, because our culture rate is still a little bit poop. So, farm there, and I'll probably build an Alcazar next door. Um, 
حتى تستسلم Really? It's not a joint war either. I mean, you'd have to be high to declare a joint war against me. Oh! <laughs> I didn't realize I've been... I have scouts over here. Well, they're dead. I should just, uh, delete them. I didn't realize I've had scouts all this time. That's fine. Um... Okay. Well... We're gonna head towards Damascus. And we're gonna steal Damascus. So, I mean, they might be coming over here or something, but... I, I don't know, I think we're okay. I'm not, I'm not too worried. They might sneak attack somewhere, but I think in the meantime they're going to lose a lot of stuff that they probably don't actually want to lose. Oh, is Amsterdam on your side? That actually is vaguely annoying. By vaguely annoying, I mean we're going to blow that up. Juno's got some walls at least, so that's okay. We've got money, we could buy some units somewhere too, so it's going to be okay. Um, I think we're going to build some Alcazars down here. And right, and you're going to be building one... Even gives us a fortification bonus in there if we want to mess with that. Uh, you're going to go and clear the rainforest. So, yeah, I mean, I don't... Okay. Arabia. Only has Amsterdam, as far as we can tell. So that's good. Although, they almost have Stockholm. So, that could be slightly annoying. It might be worth buying a unit here. Um, artillery, right, still only has range of 2. Although it does do a lot of damage, right? It's 70 versus 60. That is a pretty huge difference. Oh, I don't have enough money for that. Never mind. Alright. Well, let's see what Amsterdam's got. Show me what you got! Pray for Amsterdam. <laughs> uh, no, go away. How unfortunate, yeah. I'm sorry I'm not giving you a bunch of stuff for free, even though you're not a threat to me in any way whatsoever. How did you get shot? Does, Amst does I guess they must have gotten stuff so now the cities have a range of three. Okay, so our battleships don't go around with like complete and pure impunity, but that's okay. Oh, you, you need to be named. The Ghost Eel? That's, that's kind of funny. You are going to be named... Devrick Magius. There we are. And then you're going to shoot Damascus. Oh, submarines! Oh, that is scary then. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's, that's something. Okay. Hmm. Because we don't have destroyers. Um... I think what we're going to do is we're going to transfer you to Caveman. Get some trade routes out of there, and you're gonna get transferred over to. Uh, we're not gonna upgrade you yet, because you can actually take more damage before we start to get nervous about that. Um, I'm just gonna sit here, that's fine. What do we need for destroyers? Combined arms. Over here. Boost, build an airstrip. Mm. It's quite far, too. Yeah, I don't know. We'll uh, we'll reevaluate that. You are going to... Fishing boat. You are... Can you build another one? No, I don't think they can be next to each other. But I should build more. For more possible culture. Uh, I think I'm going to farm the hell out of this area. All right, next turn. What's the time? We've got eight minutes left to go. Arabian ship east to Flux Inductor is threatening your trade route. Oh, uh, right there. 
Yeah, we don't have any other ships over here. Alcazar. Commercial hub investment. Oh, yes. Um, I should faith buy this great engineer. Because it's too important for a victory, even though the great merchant is amazing. But that, that engineer is going to be too key. I still don't know what this is. What district is this? Is there an is Atlantis in the game? Alright, that is a fair amount of damage at this point. I will give you that. But that's okay. This guy's got a promotion waiting for him. So we're fine. Boom. So. Promotion. Better barrage. So we can bombard more things. Broke a promise. Oh, because we promised to move... Th well, yeah. They weren't right on your border. Like, settle down. Okay, there's... We can build the Bolshoi here. Um... Sure. I'm going to start on that. Um... We should actually finish our factories and things first. That would actually be better. Repair the factory. But I like the idea of the Bolshoi. It's super good. Housing here is fine. Amenities suck. It's like everywhere else. Rebuild our traders, but... Um, let me get started in the ship port, shipyard, even though it's currently going to take a million billion years to get done. Too bad we don't have anything that can upgrade um, the pikemen. I'm just going to move close to Juno over here. Oh! So you... Oh, right! If we move adjacent to it, we can see things. I forgot about that. I thought... I'm thinking of different submarine mechanics from different games. So, right, as long as we move adjacent to it, we can see the fucker, and then we can kill him. Arrgh! Alright. Um, you, I'm just gonna teleport to our capital, and you're gonna chill. So, I could've killed that earlier. Oh, well. You are gonna run to... Uh, if I ran you to Selvius, you'd go through Japanese territory. So, let's not do that. Let's go to TF2 Brum Brum, even though these trade routes are all being threatened. Uh, and right, meat shield. And farm some more. Actually, you're just going to build an Alcazar there. We can build the farm right over there later on. Someone built a wonder! Crystal Redentor! Okay. What does a vegan pirate say to his cheapman? Uh, shipmates? He says, A soy, mateys! Okay. Okay, sure. All right. <laughs> uh, does anyone know if Quill inherited Spanish religion? Um, I actually don't know. So, I can go and bop the sub. And then bombard the city. Now, the city is going to get a chance to take a shot. Yeah. Hopefully it doesn't kill the, the ironclad. It is, it's got, you know what, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Frack. Maybe I should have just killed the sub with one of my battleships. Because I'm worried that at 96 strength, it's going to kill my ironclad. And then I can't take the city. I don't know. Alright. Um, I'm going to park you just outside here and you can go to sleep. Yeah, I'm a little concerned. More Alcazars. Hmm. Well, no use worrying about that now. It happened, so we'll see what happens. Oh no, I just subbed and Quill is now killing subs! I'm so scared! Okay, it did not get destroyed. Good. Good, so then we can take Damascus and then we can use it as a, a forward point for all kinds of nonsense that we plan on doing. Um, there, was there another submarine action? I think there was more submarine action, wasn't there? Let's see if we can just take Damascus, though. Okay, I don't think we will this turn. So, okay, if we're not going to take this turn, then.
Because there was another sub-bombard on our ship, right? No, I guess not. It's only got a range of... Uh, it could have been here, but I'm not going to move closer to the encampment. How many moves do I got? Oh, I can move here and then move back. Okay, no. Because it's only got a range of two, so I think we're okay. I suppose it could be in the city, or it could be right there. No, not really. Okay, next turn we take the city. Unless the sub shows up and kills our ironclad, in which case, well, we're sad. But it's not like we're threatened. At all. Certainly we want to harbor here. It's super good. Bam. Next turn. Okay, it's going to be last turn. Last turn for the, today's stream. What's going to happen? Of course, Briarstone's going to be streaming right after me. He, I believe, is going to be streaming some EU4. Probably continuing his Korea game. Which has been going very well. Okay, we're fine. Everything's fine. Chemistry, that's okay. Lost a suzerain ship. No! Um, Juna can fire, so... Juna will. Juna can build... Uh, we're going to build an art museum, because we all ha already have one archaeological museum. Uh, you're going to fire. Actually, I should have moved you back first. Okay, but that's okay. We can finish you this way. Okay. Can we take it as is? I'm sorry, is there a cliff there? I mean, it's... It's not showing me the combat line. I don't know. Oh, wait, hold on. Sorry, this is the battleship. Derp, 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 derp. Ironclad. There we go. Major defeat. Attack ineffective. It has zero health. Zero garrison health, zero fortification health. This is my ironclad. Attack ineffective. Yeah, you guys are with me. What? It's zero hit points. Well, it didn't lie. You're right. And <laughs> your attack was for zero damage. Yes, it ended up gaining a health somehow. It's not the unit inside the city. There's no way. I mean, it's not like I could heal the ships anyway, so... I'm pretty... Like, I'm pretty sure in Civ 5, it was hard-coded that it was... It doesn't matter how damaged your city, your unit was. There was no way to fail to take a city that had zero hit point. Like, I can't bombard it more than this. I can't damage it more than zero. What I like about cities is that everything what? is king size. The beauty and the ugliness. Alright, we're gonna cancel public works. Can I get something like super build ships? It might be worth doing that now. There you go. Uh, Renaissance and industrial era naval units. Which, presumably, my... No, I don't think the battleships will count. I think those will be more modern. Amenities, garrison with unit. That's what we need is more amenities. What else can we get? Oh, liberalism. Oh my god, liberals. Yep, we're going to do that for some amenities. I think I'll get rid of Raj. It's actually hard for us to keep our, uh, our thingy. Um, and we'll get some uh, some more great merchant points or something. One garrison HP nuked your ship. I don't know. Something happened. That's for sure. Don't really understand it, but something definitely occurred. Super 
So, um, let's kill some units. You're gonna run away and heal. You're gonna run away and heal. I just need to get a land unit to take the city. Hmm. If we can get Granada in on this, maybe they could send some stuff. I don't know. Oh, there you go. I don't know why there's no freaking... Like, they released two patches at this point. Including one that said something about more alerts. And there's still no alerts when one of your cities can bombard a unit. Like, what is this... I don't understand that. Makes no sense. Ooh, escape route. There, escape on foot. It's mostly safe. Oh, the spy was killed! Aww. Alright, it's fine. But why is there no alert for when your city can bombard? Also, I'm sorry I didn't get the city down lower than zero. I should have I should have done that better. I should have gotten the city to like negative ten or something before going and try to take stuff. Ah, but it is after four. We're gonna wrap this up here. Uh, my next live stream will be on Saturday at noon, same time or well, same place. Noon is the normal Saturday time. We're gonna be playing something. We don't know what it will be yet. Uh, we have played Tropical a couple of times. We might do more of that, but we might also go and revisit some other games that have been sitting idle for a little while. Next Civ live stream will be on Wednesday, so thank you very much for coming out. And, uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it, and um, there's gonna be plenty of videos hitting the Yub Tubs today as well, too, so if you want some more content, don't worry, there'll be more of it coming soon. Thanks for watching, and see you next time, folks.